Hi Matt, it's Jacqueline over at Steamboat Motors. Here is that 2020 Raptor that you inquired about. I promised you a video walk around um, with some depth about the Carfax accident report. Um, so I've done some research in that and it was fixed. Um, there was a deer that was taken out, but thank goodness for this awesome aluminum bumper. Um, and all the plastics and everything skid plate were replaced. So we'll go over features, condition. The truck looks immaculate. Um, it was a locally owned vehicle here in Steamboat from one of our VIP customers. Um, so black on black. Okay, obviously the Raptor is going to have your upgraded wheels, tires. Um, it's got those Raptor running boards. This one specifically has a hard tonneau cover. There's that beautiful dual exhaust in the back. Um, trailer hitch and condition is wonderful. Um, it does have that power lift gate with the bed step there. It is um, fully loaded with your um, divider, all weather mats, which will be placed in the vehicle if purchased, and then your bed liner. Okay, um, actually the bed looks awesome. I don't know that they ever towed with that. Uh, full sensors, full cameras. And there's that beautiful black interior. It is a leather with a gray um, accent. Looks like there's some honeycomb cloth there. You get a good view of that panoramic roof. Um, I will say, I'm a big fan of flat floorboards in Ford. Uh, that's a big old back seat. You're gonna notice here we got heated seats. I'll go ahead and poke these boys open so you can see them. Uh, two USBs, a 120 and a 240. No, 110. Wow, I thought I was gonna be all smart and stuff and then I butchered it, sorry about that. Um, and then we got the nice little accent here in the doors with that gray two-tone. Keyless entry, you will notice car wash scratchies, but they kept it clean, that's good. Alrighty, uh, 10 point electric seat, big fan of that. We got automatic lights, we got spotlights on the side, we got automatic foot pedals, and an automatic adjustable um, steering wheel. So, we'll go ahead and get in, start this bad boy up. Oh yeah. Alrighty, does have seat settings on the door one, two, and three, um, and no fuel, which I promise is not the case when somebody purchases from us. Um, but everything's pretty accessible. If you are familiar with Ford or Raptor, um, they kind of want you focused on the road. Um, the steering wheel in a Raptor is a little bit different than an F-150. You'll notice that nice little red there. You got Raptor embleming on the bottom. It is not a flat bottom. You do get paddle shifters, which are humongous, plus and minus there. Um, on the right-hand side of the steering wheel, we have all of your volume controls for your radio station, as well as voice control for your Bluetooth. You're gonna notice down here, um, these are gonna be your different like steering ratios, comfort, normal, or sport, which will pop up in the upper display there. Um, hang up and answer for your Bluetooth controls, okay? On the right-hand side of the steering wheel, we have all of our cruise control options, including adaptive, which are gonna be these beautiful little arrow guys there. Um, once we get into the center display here, you got a half touchscreen, half manual um, buttons on this guy. And all of your four wheel drive options are very accessible on the right hand side of the steering wheel with your two high, four automatic, four high and four low. This has a locking rear axle which would be that guy there, and your trailer brake backup controller. So this has the max tow package, um, which includes that controller and your backup assist. In your touchscreen, we have audio, climate, phone, and navigation. The vehicle is included um, with that navigation system, as well as your Bluetooth um, controls. Once you get into your climate controls, you're gonna notice you have dual climate so you don't have to fight with your uh, passenger about those climate controls, um, which are accessed in the touchscreen and in the manual buttons down here. 
in the manual, we're going to notice we have heated seats, which I am blaring because it's freezing in here. Um, high, medium, and low for those heated seats. You do have air-conditioned seats as well, which I will not be using in November. Um, dual climate controls here. You have face, feet, and defrost, as well as a rear defrost, a max AC, and a max defrost there. Um, fan controls. It's got a nice um, little stash spot with a couple USB ports. Beautiful uh, offset, like, um, I don't even know what that would be. It's kind of like snake skin looking. Um, park reverse neutral drive in a manual mode in your shifter knob. Um, it's nice that there's actually a shifter knob here. Um, in that manual mode, we're gonna see those plus and minuses on the side of the shifter. Um, and that is going to be to manually shift the vehicle, or you can use your plus and minus here on the steering wheel as well does come equipped with the lane keeping assist, blind spot protection, um, and 360 degree camera. I was gonna bite my tongue if it didn't have that bird's eye view. Um, but there she is, beautiful bird's eye view. Um, it is accessed by the camera button there. Um, I will point out it does have badass speakers, a B&O system, um, so you can be jamming out as well. Big old center console. And it's in mint condition because the people that owned it before loved it. So if I missed anything or I could be doing anything to earn your business, please let me know. Look at those cool Raptor seats. That's what I'm talking about. That's what you're paying for. It's all your embleming, upgraded suspension, and just Mac Daddy truck. Um, Hopefully we can earn your business. I really appreciate you guys and the opportunity. Uh, my cell phone number is the best way to touch base with me. Have a happy Thanksgiving, and I look forward to your response soon. It's Jacqueline at Seamoat Motors, 970-778-2116. Thank you.